So this video today is about is Donald Trump the Antichrist and yes I am wearing a devil mask. So first up we're going to talk about 666 Fifth Avenue which is owned by Kushner Companies which you might think is you know not Donald Trump but Jared Kushner here he is uh, married to Ivanka Trump so it's actually Donald Trump's uh, uh, son-in-law so yeah that's gonna be the first thing we're gonna put under the potential uh, maybe Donald Trump is the uh, the Antichrist right there because uh, he owns 666 Fifth Avenue okay so Donald Trump is a smooth talker sort of like the Antichrist is supposed to be mr. Trump is a liar he is constantly lying if you ever uh, do any fact checking on the guy he's so full of shit it's unbelievable also the guy worships money like uh, that is his god right money he doesn't worship the real god he is a deceiver much like uh, the Antichrist is supposed to be so uh, Donald I think you're full of shit you're a deceiver and uh, your building is 203 meters tall which is 666 feet that's Trump Towers. Like, yeah, uh, what Wikipedia here says it's 202 meters or whatever. But if you actually add a meter to it, it's 666 feet. So I've seen other things besides Wikipedia that actually say it's 203 meters and therefore 666 feet rather than 664 feet. So yeah, he owns 666 Fifth Avenue, and he lives on the 66th floor, and it is 664, 666 feet tall. All of those things kind of just don't know, scream like Antichrist to me. Mr. Trump has like a cult of personality, right? He's basically like, he's worshipped, you know, he is like a false god to these people. He's the only one who can save them. He is, uh... Yeah, I said that already, kind of, but, uh, yeah, he worships money, like, money is his god. It's not like, you know, he doesn't, uh, worship their real god. He worships money. But his name, oh, I spelled that wrong, sorry. His name is, uh, translates into world chief, and that's, like, kind of what he wants to be, right? He wants to be chief of the world. He regularly claims to be, like, the only one who can fix everything. He's the only one who can save us. Everyone else is terrible except for him, you know? He uh, definitely only, uh, you know, cares about money. He, Christ was about compassion and Trump is about greed. It's like the uh, polar opposite. So yeah, he also uh, practices adultery, which is pretty sure one of the commandments is uh, against adultery. So he's anti-tax, and uh, Jesus said, render unto Caesar what is Caesar's. So uh, that's pretty unchristian right there. Uh, Trump supporters are like uh, like a cult. They're like uh, very cult-like behavior, and they worship him. It's, uh, it's kind of spooky to actually see these people uh, in action. He lies about his predictions. He's lied about, like... Uh, what he predicted in Iraq and Afghanistan and Osama bin Laden and uh, if you actually go back and check some of the shit that he claims that he predicted it's it's almost always bogus uh, yeah he he seems to be like he talks like he's the only one he's the messiah basically he can't nobody else can help us but him which is fucking bullshit too he's uh he's not the messiah he's the exact opposite of Christ he's uh basically the Antichrist. So, uh, yeah, I think that uh, Mr. Trump is uh, pretty much uh, right up there with the most likely candidates for the Antichrist. Like, people say this about every president, but uh, for him, it seems a little bit more likely. Like, uh, you heard about the Whore of Babylon. Well, uh, maybe uh, Mel Melania, or whatever the fuck her name is, is the Whore of Babylon pretty sure she's uh, done a lot more than just modeling if you know what I mean but uh, you know she looks kind of evil too she looks like she could be the wife of the devil for sure you know so it's uh, 
Trump is pretty uh, pretty evil looking and there's a lot of uh, other people out there suggesting that he might be the Antichrist as well so it says in the Bible that power was given uh, him all over all kindreds, tongues, and nations, and he kind of has that kind of power now, doesn't he? He's the president of the world, whether we like it or not. And he was given authority over every tribe, people, language, and nation. That's also true, isn't it not? He, he has that kind of power now, which is pretty scary. So yeah, uh, the uh, Trump crest here at his Palm Beach uh, resort or uh, compound or whatever the hell you call it has the 666 it looks like it on his uh, shield and uh, yeah there's several things here on Cora that uh, I've already most of them I've sort of covered in this video but uh, you know it's all about Trump's power egotism love of money etc his name Don which is kind of like the mafia Don means a uh, world leader uh, he wants to upstage, outrank, and triumph. Uh, and his middle name is John, means God is gracious. So it could impossible interpretation. So yeah, his name could mean uh, a wor proud world ruler after God has been gracious will attempt to upstage. And uh, the number 666 keeps coming up in regards to him. Uh, he's an egomaniac. Uh, most of the characteristics of the Antichrist in the Bible have. Uh, can be applied to him and uh, a lot of the stuff that uh, Nostradamus said was uh, also uh, applicable to the Trumpster so uh, I think that I'm gonna call it a video now cuz uh, I don't want to go over the same things more than once I don't really want to hammer it into your head uh, I'm just throwing it out there that there's a strong possibility that uh, president-elect Trump is a uh, is the uh, the Antichrist, which is a pretty scary thing to say. Uh, yeah, it also says there that he's going to uh, betray Israel, the Antichrist. And uh, Donald's already talking about being neutral on Israel, which has pretty much been supported by the U.S. for the last, you know, uh, 50, 60, 70, 80 years. So uh, that'll be a change. It's the, He's the first one to really uh, be anti-Israel, the first uh, president anyway. So, uh, Donald Trump, oh yeah, there's one other thing, that uh, he's red as hell, this guy's not even white, the great red one, look how red he is, he's not even like, he's supposed to be white, but that dude is, sometimes he's orange, sometimes he's not. So thanks for watching, and subscribe for more uh, crazy videos.